Hi everybody, Mark here. Thank you so much for joining us here. We are so excited. We just received an Illumineers trove from our good friends over at Robin's Burger. We love the Illumineers trove. There's nothing better than opening one of these. Uh, as you know, Ursula's Return is the fourth expansion of the widely popular Disney Lorcana. It is here. It hit local game stores last Friday. And uh, we got our hands on a bunch of products, but our friends over at Robin's Burger sent us the Illumineers Quest, which we're going to open tomorrow. But first, I wanted to crack open this box and uh, show you. Let's let's do some polls here. I'm so excited. So uh, again, we love the Trove. Here's why we love the Trove. Uh, you're going to get a storage box. This time around, the card dividers are actually done by Rarity. In the last set, the card dividers were done by the ink colors. This time around, it's by Rarity. Uh, you get eight booster packs, six damage counter dice in this, as well as a lure counter. So there's a tremendous amount of value from this. Uh, we've had some great pulls from our Illumineers Troves in the past. So let's see how we do here on this one. So let's open it up. Let's see what we get. Let's see if the split screen is working. Oh, look at that. That's deep. Fancy schmancy. All right. So first things first, opening up the box, you can see... Uh, here's this beautiful box, and uh, this is what that storage box looks like. And we'll take this, just set this on the side. Um, so let's pull our packs out really quick. Uh, these are those dividers. You can see that they are uh, protected in like a little wax paper. And they are, again, done by the rarity this time around. Uh, I really like that. So between this and the colors, you'll be able to divide all of your cards by color and rarity. Moving forward, uh, here are all of those packs. We'll get to those in a minute. That's the good stuff. Uh, I love these counters. I love these lure counters. The one that they give you with Ursula's Return obviously has the Sea Witch's signature colors on it. And these are absolutely beautiful. And then the dice the damage counter dice are the real gems or I, I just like them i think they're great uh they are opaque and they are blue it might be a little hard to pick up the hints of that green purple in there but you're gonna get six of those die really cool very cool all right here's the moment you all waited for let's pull Let's see what we get. All right, pack one. Are we going to get an Enchanted? Listen, I've never pulled an Enchanted from an Illumineer's Trove. So if it happens, it's going to happen here. It's going to happen here live. All right, so we have Training Grounds, the Casa Madrigal, the Hidden Ink Caster. I don't know if these are easy. How about if I do them upside down? There you go. Hidden Ink Caster. We have Anna. I love this card for draft, by the way. I think she's a great card. I've drafted twice now, and I think she's a great card for draft. Max. We have Ariel. Ursula's Plans. There's Pete. Duna. Uh, Sing Together, the new mechanic. I like this card a lot. There's our super rare Raya, and our foil is going to be Tor. That's a good start. I like it. We're getting warmed up. All right, pack number two. Let's see. Come on, baby. I'm always happy with a legendary, right? Everybody wants to pull the enchanteds. Meanwhile, I'm over here. I'm like, yo, give me a, give me a good legendary. Uh, Raya. We have Jetsam. Gus Gus. Gleam. Pluto, who likes to heal. Luisa Madrigal, love all the Madrigals in this set. Uh, Antonio, signed contract. The Imperial Bow, giving all your characters evasive. Raja is our rare. Mrs. Potts is our second rare. And there you go. Noi is our foil, also a super rare. So, very cool. Super rare and foily. Love that combination. All right. Keep on doing it. Two down. Six to go. Okay. 
the Vitalisphere. Swing into action. Dodge. Aurora. Nice reward card. Ursula. Sing four. Yow. Uh, I like these as well, the medallion weights. Love those. Our good friend, James C. Mulligan, doing the amazing artwork. Look at the artwork on that. The flounder is bomb. Avalanche, another Mrs. Potts. Dang who? And Gus Gus is our foil. All right, no legendaries yet. Fingers crossed. We'd love to get a Zaizu. We would love to get a Diablo. I'd love to get a Mulan. I wouldn't say no to you, Yensid. Just take a legendary. Love me those legendaries. All right. Uh, there we go. We have Li Shang, the Magic Broom. There's a one drop Diablo. Let's get the Diablo magic. Let's go. Uh, sell them while they see him. Cogsworth, Chien Po, the Magical Maid, questing for two. Ursula's Trickery, Felix Magical. The Imperial Proclamation. There's Anna. The card art on that is just gorgeous. Love that card art. And we have Hans is our foil. foil. What was our rare? Oh, the Imperial Proclamation. I forgot that was a rare. It is a good card. Okay, here we go. We're halfway there, ladies and gentlemen. We have four to go. Trying, hoping... We'd love to get that enchanted, but you know what? We just love, we love these cards. I don't care. Pulling packs is fun, right? Thank you again to our friends over at Robin's Burger for making this happen. We love Lumineer's Troves. We love Lorcana. We cannot wait for the set championships. Lots of cool stuff. All right, here we go. Pegasus. There's Bell. Tour again. We got that fo nice foily one before. Another Aurora. Prince Eric. Very solid. 3-3. Three, three. Thebes, the big olive. Sign the scroll. Another avalanche. Li Shang. Super Goof. I love Super Goof. He's a good card. I love this Rapunzel card. And Nessus is our foil. It's our foil. Very cool. All right, three to go on the search for legendaries. Looking for enchanteds. Do we have what it takes today? Is the luck with us? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. If it is, it's amazing. If it's not, we're just happy to pull. The quest is half of the fun. All right, let's see. We have the plank. Which is a really cool item card. I love how you sack that thing. You could just kill a hero. Boom. Done. Magic Broom. Broom decks becoming more and more viable. The Fates. Ice Block is very popular. This set has been synergizing with Ruby. Atlantica. Another Luisa Madrigal. Triton's Trident. Pain. Bruno's Return. Bring that character back and heal something. RSLS Legacy Canon. That one. There he is. We don't talk about Bruno. No, no. Oh, look at that Ursula. Super shiny. Very cool card. I like how you can quest with her and it essentially becomes a bare necessities. So she has big target on her back. So thank you again for hanging out with us. Pulling packs. It's always fun. Always a good time. We have two to go. All right, there we go. We've got Hercules, Pico, Meg, Bali, Daisy Duck, discarding your cards, Chen Po, Julieta Madrigal, healing your cards, another medallion waits. There she is, Mulan, King Triton, and the legendary. King Triton. I'll take it. And then sing together, dig a little deeper. Dude, I feel like this set, King Triton, has been like that's been my legendary. That's the one I've pulled the most of in my booster boxes. I feel like the universe is telling me to play blue. I don't know. Blue Steel, my future? 
I'm really an Amber Steel guy. But with all these King Tritons I'm pulling, I feel like the game is trying to get me to go in that direction. I don't know. All right, here we go. Last pack. Do we have last pack magic? It doesn't matter. We have magic anyway. All right. There's Tong. TikTok with his evasive Gunther. Hans. Augusta. Augustine Madrigal. I got to build a Mar Ma uh, Madrigal deck. Ariel. Another King Triton. Mulan. Saizu. Getting rid of those characters. Prince Philip. Another Ursula. And our last card is a Foily Foily Beast. Love it. And then there's obviously those cool puzzle cards. So that's it. Those are our eight packs. We've got some great super rares. We've got some great uncommons. Hey, we pulled a King Triton legendary. Not bad. Uh, we love this set. Ursula's Return is an amazing set. There are some bomb cards in the set. They are absolutely incredible. I love the synergies and I love what Ursula's Return is adding to the game. So if you have not picked up any Ursula's Return yet, what are you waiting for? Uh, products are at your local game store and of course they're going to be hitting box stores very soon. But you need to pick these up. If you're new to the game, people are texting me on our Instagram all the time and saying, Mark, I want to get into Lurkana. What do I do? Pick up a starter deck. They are an absolute brilliant way to get in the game because it's 60 cards. It's pre-constructed. Robin's Burger and the, the team over there take all the guesswork out. They're giving you 60 cards. You open up the box and you're ready to play with a partner. You can either... Uh, play the 60 you can divide that starter deck into two and play 30 and 30 there's a lot of versatility to those decks they're really fun they give you a real flavor for the game and they're wonderful we love again i cannot say it enough we love these troves they come with eight booster packs you get a lot of other stuff to help you start that collection jump start that collection and keep your collection organized these things are fantastic uh, we are going to be reviewing the Illumineers quest tomorrow. So hang tight with that because we're going to open that up and I want to show you how this thing plays. That's an amazing one and two player game. Whereas most of Lorcana is competitive and it's player versus player. In the Illumineers quest, you and your friend will team up to try to defeat the Sea Witch. It's a really fun and creative way to play Lorcana. We're going to show that to you tomorrow. That is also available as well. But uh, thanks for hanging with us and pulling some packs. Come and check back at Chip and Company. We love working with Ravensburger to bring you the latest news on Disney Lorcana. This game is everything. We absolutely love it. We just came from a draft tournament tonight here in New York. So we're playing this game as much as we possibly can. Coming home to this amazing present for Robinsberger. Just made our night. Uh, thanks for hanging out with us. If you have any questions, hit us up at Chip and Company. We would love to answer any and all Lorcana questions that you have. And of course, happy polls. And we'll see you guys real soon. Bye.